Hi, my name's Liz Peters. I'm a lecturer over the Adelphi building and I've just completed the PG CAP course. Um, I'm just going to talk a bit about the professional discussion that we had, which was really nerve-wracking initially. Um, the process was that we had um, one of the tutors from the PG CAP course and we also had um, an academic from the university. Uh, and we were assigned a twosome and we kind of went in and did the discussion with them. Um, we did get initially some kind of idea of what was going to be asked of us and kind of things that, that they would want to talk about, which was really good, so you didn't go in completely blind. Um, it felt like a nerve-wracking experience to begin with, but actually kind of once you got in there, it was quite a relaxed atmosphere. Um, they had some kind of set questions that they talked to you about. Um, and I thought it was really good actually, in terms of an assessment, it was a really good way of sitting down with somebody and for them to be able to see what you've done on the PG Cap and how you progress and what it is that you've learned and the kind of specific things that you've managed to achieve. So I think in comparison to kind of a lot of the writing element, a sitting down and having that discussion was actually massively useful both for me to kind of recall what it was that I'd done and what I'd learned and also obviously for the tutors as well to be able to see that I wasn't just writing bits of paper out that as a person I had grown and I had learned a lot from the PG cap so I thought it was a really great way of assessment and it's not as nerve-wracking as you think it is it's actually quite relaxing I think one of the best bits of the professional discussion was the fact that um, once you'd kind of been in, it was literally a matter of possibly minutes that you actually gained your feedback. Um, it came through, uh, they posted it onto your WordPress portfolio, which was just fantastic because I know not just myself, but everybody else was really anxious to kind of know how they'd done. And for us to have to wait days or you know weeks to kind of find out whether everything had gone really well or not um, would have been a horrible process to go through. So getting that instant feedback was fantastic. And the fact that we were kind of all together waiting and, and, and kind of getting it at the same time, I thought was really nice. And everybody was really pleased with how they'd done and um, and I think you know I think it's a good way to do it I know from teaching students myself that they want to know immediately how they've done um, and it made me realize it made me empathize more with my students because I was desperate to know how I'd done so the instant feedback was yeah it was fantastic really useful